It was good, everybody. So, um, I was watching this movie called Delivery Man with Vince Vaughn. And, uh, spoiler alert, if you haven't seen it yet, um, you know, in the movie, you know, it's from 2013. So, you know, if you haven't seen it, then, hey, or, you know, you could uh, not listen to the next part. But anyways, um, so in the movie, Vince Vaughn, character ends up having 533 kids right so you know it's a funny movie i recommend it uh it didn't get like the best reviews but i was surprised because i thought it was funny so um you know he has 533 kids so of course i was like damn i wonder who really has the most kids you know so i looked i looked it up and sure enough um there it's even in the guinness book of world Records. so um it was a guy by the name of, let me read it because I don't want to mess up his name. Fyodor or Feodor Vasilyev. Vasilyev, right? He's a Russian guy. Uh, what the hell was the town? Shuya, Russia, right? So Shuya, Russia. I uh, hope I didn't, you know, slaughter that. Uh, but um, yeah, he had 87 kids, right? So that's the record right but his wife is on record his first wife is on record as having the most kids by a woman right so she gave birth to 69 kids so i was blown away i was like how that you know how is that even possible right but um you know that wasn't even the craziest part the craziest part was that those 87 kids were born in just 35 pregnancies right so just within 35 pregnancies um you know, he had all those kids. So the crazy, you know, it gets even crazier. And the crazier thing is that none of those births were just a single child. Every single one were either twins, triplets, or quadruplets. So every single one, none of the births were, um, you know, just one kid. So anyways, uh, you know, I guess Guinness, there were people that were trying to, to you know, shut it down. Like it wasn't, it wasn't true, but... They say there was even a monastery that they confirmed it and you know uh anyways the guy the guy lived from 1707 to 1782 so i think it was um you know on the internet there's all these pictures but photographs were around for like another uh 40 years or something according to you know history so i didn't want to put a picture because they're all fake pictures right uh so I mean, there's really no way there will really be a picture of his wife, Valentina, or, you know, Fyodor, Fedor, however you say it, right? Vasiliev. Both of them had the same last name. I don't think it said the name of his second wife. Maybe it did. Um, so, yeah, if, if they did, I'll, I'll look it up and I'll, I'll edit it, you know, above or whatever. But, um, so let me tell you the breakdown. So, the first wife had uh and i think she lived to be 76 uh if i'm not mistaken so uh but it was within 40 years that she had the 69 kids and unfortunately one pair of twins did pass away at in infancy so they didn't make it past uh infancy right so let, let me uh tell you how you know how the kids came out so the first wife had 16 pairs of twins right so that's 32 Right, so the 32, then seven sets of triplets, so that's 21. Then four sets of quadruplets, so that's 16. So that's the 69 kids and then, you know, the two that passed away. But, uh, so that's how she had the, you know, the 69 kids, right? That's crazy. Uh, and then the second wife had six pairs of twins, so that's 12, and then two sets of triplets. So that's another six, right, so for, for a total of 18. So that's how, you know, it's recorded as, as uh, you know, and I guess there's, uh, you know, like not just the monastery, but they even published it in a magazine. Um, damn, I forgot the name of it. I'll put it up too. I think it was like Men's Something Magazine or, you know, at that time. Uh, yeah, and in the 1700s, right, they already had, um, you know, those kind of publications, magazines or whatever. So... So it even came out in a magazine, right? So, you know, they put him down like he's a peasant. I hate using that word. I don't know. Maybe he was just a farmer. But in those days, they used the words peasants, right? So that's what it says. Like a Russian peasant from Shuya, Russia had, uh, you know, um, 87 kids. And that that's the record, right? So it's pretty crazy. And like I said, 
all the pictures there's so many <laughs> pictures and i guess none of them will really be you know the you know because photographs weren't around for another you know 40 years after they passed away so i don't know you know i didn't want to put any fake pictures so i'm not gonna do that but if you guys look them up online you know fyodor vasiliev um you know i'll put the name in the description or the, the title or something um or in the description yeah right but um but yeah so yeah that's it um i thought it was pretty crazy and uh you know yeah check out that movie delivery man too it was funny that's what made me even look it up to to uh you know be curious enough to wonder like damn i wonder who really had the most kids so hope you guys enjoyed it i know it's a short video but you know it was just about that the uh, yeah, and it's even in the Guinness Book of World Records, so you guys can look it up. All right, hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.